Maps have become an essential part of our everyday lives. Whether you're planning a trip, analyzing geographic data, or building interactive visualizations, the right mapping tool can make all the difference. But with so many options out there, which ones truly are the best? In this video, we'll break down the top 10 free mapping tools, covering everything from simple custom maps to professional GIS software. Stick around to find the perfect tool for your needs. First on our list is Google My Maps. If you've ever used Google Maps to find directions or explore new places, you might be surprised to learn that Google offers another tool that takes things even further. Google My Maps. This feature allows you to create personalized interactive maps that are perfect for travel planning, education, and for all those times you want to quickly share a marked up satellite image or map with someone. So what makes Google My Maps so special? Let's take a closer look. One of the biggest advantages of Google My Maps is its ability to quickly and easily create custom maps. It lets you place your own markers anywhere in the world. These markers can be customized with different colors, labels, and icons, making it easy to distinguish different types of locations. Beyond just placing pins, you can draw routes and shapes directly on the map, which is incredibly useful for plotting travel itineraries, defining project zones, or highlighting specific regions. Each location can also include detailed descriptions, images, videos, and links, allowing you to add as much context as needed. If you're planning a trip, for example, you can mark restaurants, hotels, and attractions, and even attach reservation links or personal notes. For those who work with data, Google My Maps also allows you to import data from Google Sheets, CSV files, and KML files. This means you can easily take a list of addresses or coordinates and have them automatically placed onto a map without needing to enter them manually. Another powerful feature of Google My Maps is its collaborative functionality. Just like Google Docs, you can share your map with others and allow them to view or edit. This makes it perfect for group projects, team coordination, or event planning. One of the most convenient aspects of Google My Maps is how easily it integrates with the Google Maps app. Once you've created your custom map, you can view it as an overlay directly within Google Maps, making it simple to navigate your own personalized routes while on the go. While Google My Maps works best online, it does offer limited offline functionality. Maps can be viewed offline within the Google Maps app, but unfortunately, editing is not possible without an internet connection. This can be a drawback for travelers or field workers who need to make real-time updates without reliable internet access. Another limitation is that unlike advanced GIS tools, Google My Maps doesn't support highly detailed geospatial analysis. It's designed for user-friendly mapping rather than in-depth cartographic functions. However, for most personal and business use cases, it remains an excellent tool. For anyone serious about geospatial data, GIS analysis, or professional mapping, QGIS is a powerful open source geographic information system. It's packed with features for analyzing spatial data, creating professional maps, and performing advanced geoprocessing tasks. While it has a learning curve, QGIS is a favorite among professionals and researchers who need high level functionality. So why is QGIS so popular? Let's break it down. QGIS or Quantum GIS is open source and runs on Windows, Mac OS and Linux. It's packed with advanced features, including spatial analysis, 3D mapping, and support for a vast range of geospatial file formats. Whether you're working with shapefiles, GeoJSON, or satellite imagery, QGIS can handle it all. One of the key advantages of QGIS is its open source nature, which means it's constantly evolving with improvements and new features driven by a dedicated global community. This also means there are no restrictive licensing fees, making it an accessible option for individuals, businesses, 
and even large organizations. Many GIS professionals who have worked with proprietary software like ArcGIS find QGIS to be just as capable, if not more efficient for certain tasks. Another standout feature is customization. You can extend QGIS with plugins, automate workflows using Python scripting, and even integrate it with web mapping tools. From spatial analysis to georeferencing, 3D visualization, and even integration with databases like PostGIS, QGIS provides all the tools necessary for a complete GIS workflow. It's widely used in urban planning, environmental research, archeology, span and many other fields. For those transitioning from other GIS platforms, the learning curve can be a bit steep, but once you're familiar with the interface and workflows, QGIS proves to be an indispensable tool. It also supports multiple data formats, ensuring seamless interoperability with other mapping and geospatial software. In short, QGIS is a robust, cost-effective alternative to proprietary GIS software, offering powerful tools, excellent performance, and the flexibility needed to support a wide range of mapping and spatial analysis tasks. If you're looking for a powerful, professional-grade GIS tool without the cost of proprietary software, QGIS is the best free option. All right, quick promo time. This is where I tell you about Swivel, the platform we're building. Unlike other tools on this list, Swivel isn't free, but we do offer a free trial so you can check it out for yourself. Swivel is designed to make creating virtual site tours easy. Whether you're managing infrastructure projects, documenting real estate, or capturing remote locations, it gives you a simple, intuitive interface to map and share 360 photos, site plans, and more without needing coding or GIS expertise. If that sounds interesting, give it a try. And don't forget to subscribe to the channel to follow our journey as we build Swivel into the best tool for virtual site management. All right, next on the list is Leaflet. If you're a developer looking for a lightweight and highly customizable mapping solution, Leaflet is the perfect tool. It's an open source JavaScript library that allows you to create fully interactive maps with ease. Unlike other mapping platforms that tie you into a specific data provider, Leaflet lets you use OpenStreetMap, Mapbox, or even your own custom tiles. It's designed to be fast, mobile friendly, and highly extensible with a huge selection of plugins to add features like heat maps, geolocation, and real-time updates. Leaflet is widely used for everything from simple website maps to complex GIS applications, and its open source nature means you have full control over how your maps look and function. If you want to create powerful interactive maps without the overhead of heavy frameworks, Leaflet is one of the best free tools available. Whether you're creating a custom map for a website, building a data visualization tool, or developing a location-based app, Leaflet provides an easy to use yet powerful foundation. At number four, we have Google Earth, which is more than just a mapping tool. It's a full 3D exploration platform that lets you view high resolution satellite imagery, 3D models of cities, and even historical imagery to see how locations have changed over time. It's an invaluable tool for researchers, urban planners, educators, and anyone who wants to explore the world in detail. There are two versions of Google Earth that you should know about. The web version of Google Earth is accessible from any web browser, offering immersive exploration tools, 3D cityscapes, and storytelling features like Google Earth Voyager. The desktop version, also known as Google Earth Pro, provides more advanced tools, including historical imagery, precise distance, and area measurements, and the ability to import GIS data. One of Google Earth's most unique features is its historical imagery, allowing you to see how places have changed over time. Perfect for urban planning, environmental research, and even just nostalgia. Since becoming free in 2015, Google Earth has been widely used by educators, businesses, and hobbyists. Whether you want to explore the world, analyze geographic changes, or create virtual tours, Google Earth is an incredible free tool with endless possibilities and still remains 
one of the most visually immersive mapping tools. If you're looking for a privacy focused and fully offline mapping app, Organic Maps is one of the best free tools available. Unlike commercial navigation apps that track your location and collect data, Organic Maps is built with privacy first. It doesn't store or sell user information, making it ideal for those who prefer secure and ad-free navigation. One of its standout features is offline maps. You can download maps ahead of time and navigate without an internet connection, which is perfect for hiking, biking, road trips, or traveling in remote areas. The app is based on open street map data, meaning it gets regular updates from a global community of contributors. Organic Maps is lightweight, battery efficient and fast, making it a great alternative to more data heavy mapping apps. It also includes turn by turn navigation for walking, cycling and driving, along with detailed hiking trails and topographic features that many mainstream maps don't provide. If you want an open source privacy respecting alternative, Google Maps or Apple Maps that works anywhere, anytime Organic Maps is one of the best free mapping tools available. For professionals working in surveying, GIS and field data collection, SW Maps is an incredible free tool that makes it easy to capture, analyze and visualize spatial data directly on your mobile device. Unlike many other mapping apps, SW Maps is designed for field work, meaning you can collect GPS points, record tracks, attach photos and notes, and export everything in formats like KML, GeoJSON, or shapefiles. It's commonly used for land surveying, environmental monitoring, construction planning, and even disaster response. One of its most powerful features is the ability to connect to external GPS receivers, allowing for high accuracy data collection, a must for professionals who need precision beyond a standard smartphone GPS. It also integrates with OpenStreetMap and Google Maps, so you can overlay and compare different data sets. Despite its professional level capabilities, SW Maps is completely free, making it one of the best mobile GIS apps available today. Whether you're working on field surveys, mapping projects, or just need a robust GPS tracking tool, SW Maps is a fantastic free option. If you love outdoor adventures, tracking your runs, hikes, or bike rides, Relive is a must-have mapping tool. Unlike traditional maps, Relive transforms your activities into stunning 3D video stories, letting you relive and share your journeys in a way that's more engaging than just a static map. The app integrates with popular fitness trackers like Strava, Garmin, and Apple Health allowing you to take GPS data from your workouts and instantly generate a visualized replay of your route. You can also add photos, customize your video, and share it with friends or social media followers. While the free version offers the core experience, it should be noted that there is a paid version called Relive Plus that unlocks additional features like HD video quality, music, and more customization options. At number eight, we have OpenStreetMap, often referred to as the Wikipedia of maps. It is a completely free and open source world map created and maintained by a global community of contributors. Unlike proprietary maps controlled by big companies, OpenStreetMap is built and updated by people like you, making it one of the most detailed and frequently updated maps available. So what exactly does OpenStreetMap include? Pretty much everything you'd expect from a world map and more. It covers roads, buildings, addresses, shops, businesses, points of interest, railways, hiking trails, public transit, land use, natural features, and much more. Because the data is contributed by real people, OpenStreetMap is often more accurate in remote areas than some commercial mapping services. What's even more interesting is that OpenStreetMap is often the foundation for many other mapping tools. If you've used maps in apps like Leaflet, Mapbox, or even Swivel, you've likely interacted with OpenStreetMap without realizing it. In Swivel, 
we use OpenStreetMap as our illustrated base map, providing a detailed and user-friendly visual layer that enhances spatial data. The best part, anyone can contribute to OpenStreetMap, whether you want to update your neighborhood, add missing trails, or improve local business listings. It's completely open for editing. That makes it not just a mapping tool, but a community-driven project that helps keeps maps relevant and up-to-date. Coming in at number nine, Mapbox Studio is an incredibly powerful tool for developers who need high levels of customization in their maps. While Mapbox itself is a paid platform, it does offer a free tier, making it a great option if you need a map with limited usage or if you're experimenting with custom map designs. Unlike some of the other tools on this list, Mapbox Studio isn't a drag and drop mapping tool for casual users. It's built for developers. If you're comfortable with coding and designing interactive maps, this tool gives you full control over the look, feel, and functionality of your maps. You can customize everything from colors, fonts, and labels to terrain shading and real-time data overlays. One of the standout features of Mapbox Studio is its ability to work with vector tiles, which allow maps to load quickly and scale smoothly, no matter how much data you're displaying. It's also a favorite for apps and websites that need dynamic interactive maps, thanks to its robust API integrations. For those looking to go beyond standard maps and create something truly unique, whether it's a real-time traffic map a weather with visualization or a highly stylized geographic interface, Mapbox Studio is one of the best free tools to get started with. Just keep in mind that if your map starts getting high usage, you may need to move to one of their paid plans. Rounding out the list at number 10 is Apple Maps and MapKit.js, Apple's mapping platform and web API for integrating Apple Maps into apps and websites. While Apple Maps itself is free for users on iPhones, iPads, and Macs, MapKit.js offers a free tier, making it a viable option for developers who want to build custom interactive maps without relying on Google or Mapbox. If you're developing for the Apple ecosystem, Apple Maps provides a seamless experience with smooth animations, high quality satellite imagery, and detailed 3D city models. MapKit.js, Apple's JavaScript API, allows you to embed Apple Maps into web applications, add annotations, overlay custom data, and provide interactive map experiences. A major advantage of Apple Maps is its strong privacy focus. Apple doesn't track users' location in the same way that some other mapping platforms do. This makes it an appealing choice for developers who prioritize user privacy. This makes it an appealing choice for users who prioritize user privacy while still offering a polished, high-performance mapping experience. One limitation is that MapKit.js is primarily designed for Apple users. If you're building something cross-platform, Google Maps, Mapbox, or Leaflet may offer better compatibility. However, for developers creating iOS apps or web experiences optimized for Safari users, Apple Maps and MapKit.js are excellent free options with a generous usage allowance. There you have it, the best free mapping tools. Which ones are you excited to try? Let me know in the comments below. If you found this video helpful, hit that like button and subscribe for more mapping tips, tools, and tutorials. Thanks for watching and happy mapping.